Good evening, Nashville. This is Terry Schrader. I'm the executive principal here at Hillsborough High School, and you're watching Borough TV on the NECAT Network. We're so excited about the new era here at Hillsborough, and we want to show you everything going on in our school. Go Burroughs. It'll be different. Uh, some of the guys who coached with me last year are still there. Um, our defense is playing fast right right now, so we just feel like we can get after them and cause some chaos for some of those younger players on offense. I mean, it's just showed me, it's built me a lot of character, showed me how to work hard. It takes all your energy out just to calm down and just reset yourself. It's what everybody's talking about, the big game on Friday. Good evening and welcome to Burrow TV. I'm John Jointer. And I'm Ambria Crutchfield. As you may know, most of the Hillsborough coaching staff came to us from Franklin High School. And on Friday, they'll be back in Franklin, but this time on the other side of the field. Uh, some of the guys who coached with me last year are still there. And I brought some guys with me over here. So uh, I got the best end of the deal, the ones I brought. So. Uh, it, it'll be different. Uh, it'll be a, uh, those that go to the game, it'll be a different crowd than you've seen all year because it'll be packed. And uh, they're going to be raising heck from the uh, kickoff to the end. The band will never quit playing. The students will never sit down. Uh, it'll be great, uh, great to go see how the game should be played and how the enthusiasm should be. They might throw a few wrinkles in there, but that's the beauty of our offense is that just if you do one thing, doesn't mean we can't hurt you in another way. So we're going to be big on adjustments that week. We've been looking for this game for the whole season, and you know our coach is coming from Franklin, so it's going to be a lot of um, energy and um, excitement into that game. But we're just going to come out there and have the same game plan and get the W. One player who's anticipating this game is quarterback Porter Streeter. And as Borough TV's Devron Inslee explains, Porter is no stranger to hard work. He's not the fastest, he's not the strongest, but he's probably the smartest player on the field. Porter Streeter is Hillsborough High School's starting quarterback, and he's just kicking off his first season as a starter. It starts in the offseason, you know, I, from about the beginning of the offseason, you know, I got, I started throwing a lot, started working out. Um, it takes a lot of preparation, you gotta get your mind focused, you gotta know what to do. But the life of this high school quarterback hasn't always been easy. So when I was a little kid, you know, I used to be the star or whatever. And then when I got, when I hit about middle school, I didn't get to play. So it taught me how to work hard and how to earn a spot. So he just never gives up. He always fights through it. Um, all the I was with him actually every day during the off season, like doing all his hard work and stuff like that. And the dedication that he just put into the game, like. He just, that just makes him a tough person all around. Porter gives it 110% every day in practice. I, I can't be more pleased with his effort in practice. Uh, every rep, he's trying to get it to, to be a game type rep, meaning he's taking it past game speed. Uh, that way, when he gets to a game, it's going to be it's going to be a little bit slower for him, and that's hopefully what we're trying to recreate in practice. And Hillsborough football coach Patrick Murphy says that's exactly what it takes to stay on top. He's really good at making reads. Uh, he's understanding the, the purpose of a pre-snap read. That helps slow down the play while in the play. So in order for him to uh, to make the correct throw, he's having to he's having to analyze and digest a lot before the play even happens. I just know I have to go out on the field and execute. That's just my job, you know. Reporting for Burrow TV, I'm dead running. There's no question that on the football field, it can get a little intense. Borough TV Jamoke Carr tells you how one football player keeps it together. One thing we know for sure is that when a football player is in the heat of the battle, emotions run deep. From sacks to blitzes and interceptions to fumbles, football can hurt your body and your pride. It takes all your energy out just to calm down and just reset yourself, just start back over. But this high school senior has a strategy to stay calm. 
on the field. I'm, I may be a weird person, but I talk out loud on the field. Like, if I see, I, I, I'm, I'm a talker. I yell, like, if I see him coming this way, I yell, scream, holler. Whether it's on the field or off the field, these players are learning the discipline of controlling their emotions. Charles is a tight end on the varsity football team and has been playing here at Hillsboro since his freshman year. Reporting for Borough TV, I'm Jamal K. Carr. It's a new era here at Hillsborough High School with new and exciting things happening in each of our academies. Here's a news update from one of our academy principals. Hey, I'm Craig Hammond, the principal of the Academy of the International Baccalaureate Diploma Program here at Hillsborough. And we're extremely excited about this school year. We're building off the success from a great school year last year with over 200 college credits earned in our academy last year. And also we're excited this fall to have a National Merit Scholar as one of our seniors has earned that prestigious award. So we're very excited about this year and we're gonna keep you updated with all our success as the year moves forward. Thank you and go Burroughs. That's it for us. Up next is the Borough Blitz. And remember, for up-to-date news on Borough TV, check out borotv.com.